Hey folks, get your fresh meat. Welcome back to Manor Lords. Um, I've noticed it takes a lot longer to load this uh, the save now than than before the update. So there's a lot more going on under the hood, and there's a lot going on um, on the ground here too. In between episodes, I spent some time trying to get them to harvest the field so that I could go through and empty them, and then it became September and they gave up all that I had told them to do and they went to the ones that I hadn't told them to do because now they have to do it and so nothing got actually completed and yeah they're, they're, they're now working on other fields and, and I can't do anything as far as deleting the old ones to set new ones until everything is taken out of the fields even the one you know just the, the produce that, that was created I did it once in between episodes just to see what would happen and it deleted this as well and it didn't exist anymore. So it is somehow tied to the field itself. You delete the field, its produce is gone. So we have to wait for them to collect everything. And I also found out that even though it had said wheat here, meaning last year what they just harvested, it's counting this as the next year. So they're already, they were already over there trying to, uh, to harvest, to plow and start all over again. So I need to manually go through and fallow all of these out if I want to change the fields once they uh, collect all this stuff. But they won't collect it until they have completed everything. It's, it, it's, it's, a, it's, it's circular. Yeah, it's, it's a mess. Anyway, let me do this to all the fields except for the ones that are still being worked on. And then we'll figure out what to do next. Are you officially done? You are not. There is still 99% of... There's one left. You are already trying to to plow the next field. So that's what I mean. I've got to shut all these down. You still have... You're done, fallow. Alright, so you're fallowed. I missed anything? Saw pit finished. Wait a minute. Was it just that? There's a lot of noise. Uh, fallow. In fact, I'll leave it paused right now because I need to... Uh, or will I? No, I have. they have to pick it all up. Okay. So, fallow you. And... No, you're still waiting. So, these two are still waiting. Okay. Um, so, I've got six in here. I've got two in here. Let's get rid of you two. Put you in here. And let's go ahead and get this one set at Plow Station so you're ready for next time. Now, I'm not sure how this episode is going to go because there are too many unknowns. When we set all these curves, we set them around huge swaths of high fertility. Um, this was all barley. Now, I don't know how to quantify this because we did use the nutrients in this area this was all flax and it's not showing us anything there will it come back well this was barley we remember we set all this up took the trees out we just never used it we didn't put the field in yet now it's only showing this little tiny bit that would have been this all this here it's like they took what was the highest fertility and you know, took it down by, I don't know, 50% throughout the whole place. If you remember in, in Gimli, Emmer, this was going to be a, an Emmer, a wheat field, wheat farm over here. We were going to carefully take the trees out. If you remember, I was worried about getting into this and getting rid of the animals, but the Emmer the highest emmer fertility took a swath out of here but I figured that wasn't enough to lose to, to risk moving the animals so we just deal with it over here and now it uh, it doesn't exist anymore there is no more high fertility emmer and this whole area was the second highest so we we're gonna we we're going all the way into right over here so yeah it, it uh, the update changed a lot it really did. So, am I running? I'm running. So, we're waiting for them to pull out and empty the fields completely. 
like this. You are fellow, and I don't see any hint of anything happening there. So we can demolish you and bring you back. But I don't know what to put in there. That's what I'm getting at. Um, barley, flax fertility may come back. It may not. I think we could still deal with just the two positives. But there's something else to think about, too. Will this restore on its own over time? Or does it require having the field here set to fallow in order to add nutrients for a year for a fallow field? Will the ground restore on its own or does the fact that there is a pasture or a field with fallow on top of it that adds the green back in because if you know the game's programmed to do that to a fallow field but if there's no field will it restore so there are questions i don't have answers to <laughs> yeah well can i hit Control z and put that back in um let's go here and do just that i don't no let's note let's not we'll leave you and you will continue to change over the next year without you know doing anything to you and see if you get a buff back over a one year period compared to the field that's going to sit fallow and are you finally done you are fallow and see if you get the buff back but you don't because you actually had a field and you didn't so there's a test there so we had deleted one field here two fields here i think there were two fields in there so i don't know if that's going to return to us as a boost in um in barley or not i don't know what's going to happen there hmm so that's the test that needs to be done so do we and i'll pause because I, I do need to get some things done in september without too much time running by do we abandon the idea of farming for a year and just let all of these these fertilization fields you know normalize and revitalize on their own and then then see what the final product is and then place new fields over those spots or do we come up with alternate areas just to get something in even though it's going to be very inefficient for a year i think that's the answer i think it is did we clear anything out over here uh pull out of all of you you look empty you are Gathering an ox. Gathering. So you are on your way to maybe pick this stuff up. And you're all picking up that one. Okay. So I've just got to make sure that everything here did land in fallow. There wasn't anything still being worked on. Fallow and wheat. Fallow. Okay. And I think I'm going to just abandon this one. Um, C and Emmer. We're down to one plus everywhere and less than over here. In fact, you can just go away. No, you can't. You still have, yeah, sheaths in the field. So we can't do anything with that. But the rest of these, I'll leave them. But we're, they're going to remain fallow for the year. And we'll see what improves underneath of them. And over here, so we're not going to be doing anything over there for Emmer now for one year. Which means we may have to, hopefully, this will be satisfied someday, the spears. But instead of bringing barley back, maybe we'll be bringing uh, bread back. Maybe that's going to have to be a thing. Now, if it is counting these guys, is it? we got 210 wheat now from this whole entire harvest. That's quite a bit. That's quite a bit. That's uh, 420 loaves. Yeah. Okay. So, two ten four twenty. Yeah. So that's going to uh, that's going to last us for quite a while. In fact, we need to get this guy uh, upgraded. Finally, we do. You're doing that. I'm going to leave it paused because I want to get a bunch of fields set over there, and I'm going to need the last you know ten weeks before snow hits to do that but we were trying to get planks over here last time we were fighting that we have only five let's let you run a little bit longer okay um and over here we've got four families left you let's put two in there to help out 
All right, so you're set for a while. And I want to spend a bunch of time over here. So what is actually happening in Gimli? Let's just peek over here and see what's going on. Four families are working. One is building. What are you building? We needed the planks uh, over here. And you... Nobody in there. And... How best to... What, where are our families right now? There's nobody in here for the berries. Correct. Okay. So that one's done. We have food-wise... We need firewood. So firewood is the big challenge right now. And that's very quickly resolved once we get this guy built. Let's get you built. And... That's highest. And you're high. You're very high. Those two over the top of these houses. I think that would be wise so you are medium medium and medium we already have this one's in yeah so we have room for our next one so let's get boy if I can get leather in here I'd actually get that above 50 wouldn't I let's make you the very high and let's make you the highest okay food wise we're sitting on three meat and 17 berries yeah, I better keep you in here for a while. Two meet over there. Okay, so other than that, so one and click, click, click. There we are. Um, one's in there. I need you to sell firewood. You are in here. I don't necessarily need you to do this. Let's pull you out. You can go ahead and run the stall. That is on. That is on. So you can run the food stall. Because you don't, have, you have almost nowhere to, you know, no distance to travel. So there's, it's already super efficient. So we can handle that. So that gives us two families to get in there and get some of the construction done. And or I can put one of those families into here if I can get you to actually bring the logs over. Let's do that. We have two oxen over here. Let's give you an ox for a little while let's just do that one ox you guys get a few of those and then we will you are 10 timber let's pull you out okay so that's 10 timber unassigned surplus so there's already enough to do all the construction projects so let's have one family moving logs into here turn them into planks so we can get things like this upgraded we can get the church in to make them happy we can get somebody in the tannery just to get a little bit of leather done and make them happy okay pause you that's functioning i think i can walk away from this for a while all right so is it here that i can hit t it is so t takes me to that is samwise yeah so t happens here i, I usually see it up in here no it isn't here anymore. It used to say that. I was trying to figure out why it wasn't in my face. Um, we are... How far into this now? 10, 15 minutes? We haven't had an attack. This is the first episode in a long, long time that they have not been posted up in here. And no bandit camp has shown up. Interesting. I didn't know what the effect would be. Were the bandit camps showing up because... They were posted up here. Is there anything in the code that that connects those dots? Or did the update change that? But last time, last episode was the update of, of 972. And yet we had a bandit camp jump in within five minutes. So this is the only factor that has changed right here. So we'll try and keep an eye on that too and see if that ever changes. All right, so everything... I think I can I can just concentrate over here for a while. So we are going to leave you pause. We are going to fallow, 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 wheat. You can fallow. You are wheat and you're still working on that tiny little patch right there. Okay. And you do have eight families that are doing all this work. So what happens after this? We saw, let's see here, um, what do I want? Construction. Let's go with flax. There is an area over here. 
It's not where we have been working with flax, but we could use this area to give us a band-aid. Uh, saving, okay. How quick, how often are my saves? Gameplay saves every 15 minutes. Hmm. I noticed while I was working on this in between episodes, it seemed like it came up an awful lot of times for every 15 minutes. So if we were to put some flak fields over here, then... And just use this for this year or this year or next year while we're waiting to see what returns naturally. I think that might be a way to get around not doing anything at all to, to see what happens. So what do we got here? Four or five Morgans? I think that's a reasonable guess. Let me run some roads around that and see what we're what we've really got. Okay, well that's that's decent. Let's throw a field in there just out of curiosity. How far can I swing this guy around? There we go. 5.7 Morgans. Okay. So if we were to divide this and then run some boy, how to do that. So five point and halves, that's 10, 11 fields into there. Hmm, 11 fields. How do you deal with 11 fields in a space like that? Let me stare at this a little bit and see what I come up with. Okay, well, I was thinking about cross-dividing this thing all over the place and making 11 spaces, but I think that's, uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's going to drive me nuts. So <laughs> let's just go for it. So roughly half Morgan sizes like that. That would be fine. One and so oops, you're gonna be a little bit narrower. Where do you? You're yep, that works. So I'll run through this thing and see what I can come up with. Okay, that's not bad. It gives me five fields at a half Morgan each, and I might leave this one. Leave the trees. Don't know if this is permanent or not. If it is, we'll set that one up later. But that's basically five fields for one year, then five fields for the next. We can just rotate them, you know, fallow and and uh, and make that one work. So that's we'll, we'll call this the uh, uh, the flax farm. Maybe we'll put another farm building in if this turns out to be permanent, and these folks would just be responsible for nothing but flax and just rotating back and forth with fallows. Okay, so with that, and do I turn that on now that there's something for them to do? Oh, I guess I need to tell them flax, huh? So I'll do this Be right back. Okay, so these are all flax. That one, these are all fallow now. So there's, yep, there's a, there's a job for them to get started on. So they're going to finish this one out and then they'll move on and start working on these and that gives the oxen something to be doing too advanced we were both both oxen are in there okay and the one family that's left because we're eight yeah can be maybe upgrading this maybe we can get a third or even fourth third okay do we have the ability to get another ox it said there's five spaces five spaces so you are um, livestock, there's only one in here. So let's get another ox into this one. And, or actually, I probably should have done it right here, huh? <laughs> there's, yeah, that's, that was, he would have been closer, but that'll work for now. Too late. All right, so you are working on all of those. I've got to think about barley now, and then some emmer. But it's getting dark, so apparently there is a storm coming in. Uh, thumbs downs. Oh, that is still here. We are still waiting. These guys are still not happy about not having tavern, uh, ale, or another kind of food, or another kind of food, or another kind of clothing. So there's the disadvantage of getting the the tier two burgage plots going too quickly just to try to get some points. If you're not ready to really satisfy them yet, then you're going to see this sink. So keep that in mind. Um, if you had, you know, 40 le a tier one plots, they would all be, you know, happy as clams, and you'd you'd see this go up to, you know, near a hundred percent. But you wouldn't have the advantage of setting the. Did we? Yeah, brewery. 
getting the the ale going what do we have in that regard so we've still got 133 barley and we are sending some barley over there um in a trade for spears where are we over here uh you no that's gandalf spear militia you gandalf where is we're 36 of 36 now okay pause so you're saying we, we got all the spears and the shields over here now. We did. Wow. Took them long enough, but somehow in that last little bit, they uh, they got around to doing it. I wonder if the pack horses finally started to haul their, their full load. Aha. Uh -huh. Again, stay paused because I don't want a whole bunch of unneeded spears and shields over there. So what else do we send over there? Hmm. i got to think about that. Now, what do we have over here? They needed... Tier 2 needed what? Uh, right there. You needed more food stall supply for things. What do we actually have in food here? We have berries. We have no meat and no veggies. Okay. So, I guess in place of spears, we could be sending meat over. Just to give them a little bit of variety. We could do that. So, you are next to this storehouse. You guys are closer to... I guess they're all the same distance from the the granary. Let's just switch you guys over to meat. So meat is... How far? How many scrolls down? Three down. So meat for barley and... Meat for barley and meat for barley. And then what's another thing that would do us some good? We could send some berries back. We did steal all their berries. We really did. Um... We have lots of leather, but they have lots of leather too, so that's not going to help. We do need other things. We need flax over there. We need linen over there. We need eventually bread over there, but no, not not for quite a while though. Um, yeah, that's the barley and the, and the flax, or the malt and the leather, or the uh, linen, or the ale and the clothes, depending on how far you want to process it here before you send it back over. But right now, I think the best thing is just to get them some food variety. So it's either going to be vegetables or it's going to be uh, uh, berries. And I think berries is probably the best way to go for a while. So let's set you guys to berries over here. We'll just kind of swap goods back and forth for a while until we, uh, until we figure out what we really want going on. Berries were further down. Yeah, you're there. And berries down here at the bottom. And one more time, you berries. So we'll we'll just do that while I'm not able to concentrate on things. Okay, so I don't know what spurred this on that made me look at the spears, but actually I don't remember what it was. It had something to do with the happiness. Yeah, okay, something like that. All right, so barley, barley, barley. There was an area, this whole area was barley. And I want to see what comes back over time. Will this field go back to dark green again with a fallowed season? Will this also? Or will it not because there's no longer a field on here saying fallow to make it do that? Or is fallow no longer here anymore because the update took it away? So those are all the unanswered questions. We are still in September, but a lot's going on. Livestock, policies available somewhere, and burgage pot, burgage pot, gimli, gimli, and storage is full. Okay, pull out of here, Stor storage, storage. This is the little storage meant just for iron uh, ore, and you are, what? Collecting shields and wooden parts and barley and pole arms and iron ore like you're, and clay like you're supposed to. And log piece transitionary resource. What does that mean? Log piece. I don't know what that means. But you are... These are all turned off except for clay and iron ore. Oh, and I forgot you. But still, barley's not turned on. And what else was in there? Uh, general. Barley and wooden parts are not turned on. Why are they coming all the way down here? They made way up the hill. 
Hmm. <sighs> okay, can I do this? I need 10 more planks. Planks in the system. Planks in the system. There's something that changed with the update and we didn't get into. Joiner shop. You guys need to stop using up all of our planks. No, I guess I did set this in between episodes. I set that. So now we have a construction reserve of 20. So don't use us any planks if they're less than 20. So the 20 are left for construction. So that's not it. Um, no family. No family. That's, that, that's probably it. Yeah. Two. Let's put... Uh, log storage of one, log storage of four. Let's put a family in here, get some bill. So we'll come back and get him upgraded here soon when we can afford it. Now back to the idea of barley. So it's this area that naturally had barley. What does it have now? Uh, barley. So this here, this area over here we did not get into. We cleared out the trees to put one, two, three, four barley fields in. And I was going to split all these in half and get eight barley fields. And then the update hit. So this area over here we have not done anything with. So let me draw this out and partition it into fields. And I'll be right back. All right. Well, that's approximately half Morgan's uh, fields for, for barley. So we got six of those. Maybe the same idea. Three on, three off. Five on, five off. Okay. So... Let's set that real quick. You three? Yeah, you three will be barley. All right, so Emmer. What do we do with Emmer to really get this going again? But I guess I can let you run. Yeah, I can let you run. Um, this road doesn't necessarily exist anymore because it was meant to curve around other things. Um... Where to put you? Do I want to get up in here? I guess we could. Let's let's maybe just connect you into here. And be great to leave those trees though. Um let's see, construction emmer. How best? And how many? What do we have in the way of we got 158 wheat, so less wheat over here than over there. And I think both of these are going to need to be shipping food over there to Gimli for a while while Gimli uh, tries to get on his feet. Hmm, where to put it that makes sense? Uh, we've got this area here. I don't know what's permanent, so I hate to wipe out all these trees, and I don't want to take the time to put the to take the trees out. So let's just play with, I have this whole area. So let's play with here, there, there's 0.7. So a little further back, there, and there. Six, we'll go with 0.6. There's an emmer. Um, something more like this. That's interesting, okay. So a little further, there's a 0.5. That works. And you're going to be probably a 0 0.7. 0 0.7. We'll go with that. Oops. Right there. So there's three emmers, three barley, five flax. And I want to get heavily into linen production because the gambesons are linen. Which I, I noticed that on Simi's uh, latest episode. It's two linen for a gambeson. Weren't those before one wool and one one uh, linen? I thought they were. That's what I remembered. You're going to be wheat. You are going to be wheat. And you are going to be wheat. You are fallow. Oops, pause. You are fallow. They finished it. And you are fallow. Okay. Was there one over here that didn't get fin turned off? No, we got to it. You're fallow. Okay. So everything is in over here. Over here, we're going to start very heavily working on these fields. So that group there and that group. And I need as many people doing it as possible. So have we got this one? We have not. Can I... What do we have in the way of logs? We have plenty. You need to come out and you two are out. You are not being run by anybody. Um, malt house can come out and large storehouse one of you can come out and where's the it's over here 
this guy, one of you can come out. You are stable. You nobody's in the oven. Nobody's in the the uh, windmill. So you guys can quickly get this farmhouse built, so we can get everybody into there and get all hands on deck to get everything here planted. Uh, we're, we're such a late start. I'm worried about uh, worried about how that's going to come out. Is there anybody else? My mind is in too many directions right now. You can come out and tavern there's nobody down in here and speaking of here it's something else i need to talk about this episode um i think we're good there no so we're waiting just for this once that gets done will i get a message samwise stocks are getting soaked storage 53 supplies what does that mean that was barley? Wait a minute here. Do that again. Storage. Supplies. What is here? Supplies 50, 63. Huh. So I deleted a field before they were picked up. So they don't cease to exist. They just don't show anymore. Interesting. There's 63 barley that really needs to be picked up and barley goes into here storehouse new barley new let's just check that out again you do go in here advanced barley's right there and you're checked and that was barley right it doesn't give me a name there it is barley so i need you guys go pick that up before it goes bad what's it leave me with two two people can go and work on this and it's basically almost done okay so once that hits uh probably just took everybody away who was working on it huh <laughs> are you gonna do it okay ot you're going to you're gonna save the day here it's just two more bangs of a, of a mallet and you'll have it ready boom boom nope boy that's that's impressive work i wish i could build a shed like that thank you okay so in that case there's no more construction going on that needs livestock, so let's do... I wish it wouldn't pop me out of that, so I could do both. And you're waiting for the next one to arrive. Okay, so when that arrives, all four will be in here, and everybody else can be in here with one, two, three, four, waiting for that to get picked up from you guys so I can empty you again. So with that, we're waiting for this and that was odd now well i hate to to do it if i put a field back in there would that make the farmers go and do it or would it delete it they probably wouldn't let me put a field back in there would it you you it would am i about to delete hmm i was about to go hit save but it just auto saved on me so i'll I'll, I'll run the experiment and find out. I, I can't afford to lose 63 barley just because I didn't know what the rules are. But if I do that, uh, you don't like it because there's barley in the middle or because you don't like only 0.1 Morgan? No, nope, because there's barley in the middle. So it won't let me do it anyway. So I just need someone to get out here and do this. Oh, that's frustrating. The other way to do it would be to put somebody in the malt house and let them spend all their time doing that let's go let's go both routes put you in the malt house not here yeah you're the next ones so you're in there now you're in there now so we'll go ahead and get you geared up for whoever's left okay all right so we'll come back to you in a little bit but we are ready to go yeah five three and three we've got eight families and two potentially five or six families and the only hiccup right now is that somehow we lost all of our barley on the ground barley in the system is 130 so where's the rest i didn't see any in the large storehouse it's not there and it's not in here is it all sitting in the malt house? No. Three. According to this, we have a lot more barley than I can find. All right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. 
barn, a farm. There's a bunch. And over here, flax. Okay, it's sitting over here. So I need somebody to go get it. And I would think that they would haul in. Am I not? I'm not running. That they would haul in the. What have you got? Look at this. Is that a mistake? Or are you out to go and fix something? Did, did a plow break down? <laughs> okay, that's that's a first. That that really is interesting. Uh huh. That is Viet. Okay. I, I gotta know. I gotta see what he's doing. He's making a beeline for over here. Is he going to assemble a plow? Piece by piece. Is he building a cart? Is he carrying a cart? Piece by piece. What is really going on here? So you are plowing by hand. You just have a, a wagon axle and wheels stuck to you. Okay. <laughs> Gotta love early access games. <laughs> so, you guys are doing your things. So, I'm waiting to see what happens here. And let's just count that again. So, 62. We'll come back later and see if that changed. Now, over here, what was going on? We were waiting for something to be built. Um, we needed planks. Did the planks happen? Planks have not happened. Do you have any... You have one log. So it is possible people, the people, one person is crafting. So when you have a an ox in the saw pit, you know, assigned to it, what I've found is that one person will come in with the ox, move it, then go take the ox back. And then someone will come in and craft it and then go back. And then someone will bring the ox and move the log and bring the ox back. So it's very inefficient. But getting the everybody else to move the logs over especially this far away this is kind of a mistake getting this trying to do it this way um maybe i will tr make the transition right now let's do that so livestock advanced minus so you are no longer part of so you're just being led back now you're being led back so hopefully one of you guys just picks up the order from wherever you're going which is probably right here to you're probably going to get in the log unassigned guiding an ox you are guiding an ox you are gathering and you are gathering so it defaults to pulling the logs out of the forest first before it will put anything into here we have two logs here so we're going to get 10 planks out of it and that gives us 10 planks so with the 10 planks we needed a bunch more for the church but that's what's going on over there. We needed the tannery built over here. They're now working on that. Uh, highest, and we need more logs brought over. Okay. So once that's done, and this is done, we'll reposition those two families into here and get that going again. And that should help our boost our happiness. Oh, if we can get just one more point. Just one more point. I don't think we can. I don't think we can. Yeah, I don't know how to add more food variety. We've uh, we can add food quantity, but not variety. Hmm. Okay. Um, do we still have? Yeah, we're st we're still represented. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess there's not much more we can do. You are thankfully working on this, and we have, and we're waiting for the sixth family to come in to help her out. Yeah, your name isn't uh, Beatrix, is it? No, it's not. So okay. <laughs> So over here, have I? Oh man, I left these guys in all this time. All right, pull all of you out. That was a mistake. I could have had so much more done over here. All right, well, we only lost actually a couple of weeks. I've been paused most of the time laying fields, so not too much of a tragedy. So you are down in here and I need that to be upgraded. And I have nine families to do it. I need you at the highest priority. You are the highest priority, all right. And I need people pulling stuff out of the hunting storage. So pantries. I need granary workers, granary workers, and eventually granary workers. So you did get upgraded or you're being upgraded? Large granary. Let's put all of you in there. Let's get all that run out. Gimli is running out of fuel. Yep, they have it. They, 
It's just a matter of getting that place built. Um, they'll be fine. And let me think here. What else do we want to do with six families? We have wheat now. So let's get two of you up and running there and one up and running here. We don't need it just yet, but I will forget to put them in later. So I better just do it right now. Otherwise, um, how bad are we here? One more in there, maybe to start hauling some of the excess goods out of this one that's just laying on the on the ground. Okay, so at least three families to get you built, and that should be doable. How are we doing? What was that last? Something just popped. Uh, no storage space left for saw pit. Saw pit. Um, did that say Gandalf? It did. So, saw pit is over here. So where are we at right now? We are 36 planks. And you are a family. You're running out of generic storage for the planks. Okay. So we'll take you out. You are already out. And could put you into there. We have 19 timber. We have three families running it. Let's put one in here. We'll just cycle these back and forth for a while. We need more people in here to be pulling those planks out. And I don't want to go less than three at the moment. Another noise. Family members join Gandalf. Where are you living? Are we ready to start building chicken coops? Uh, tab, that's what I want. So we've satisfied these first five. And one of these. You are... Spin around, get that out of my face. There we go. You are... Hmm. Interesting. What are you? There's this and this. Normally it's, you know, a, a pile of, of junk or a boat being built or something. Why does this look like it's two, like three houses? Huh. Now I guess it is a pile of junk. It's just not what I'm used to seeing. Okay. Um, so I, I wish I could see that backyard again. I can't. And you're interesting the way you build. Huh. <laughs> okay, so you are just going to have to be something like chicken coop. It's not going to be as efficient, but that's just what it's... Oh, all of these are doubles? All of these are doubles. That's right. So we have the ability to put a lot more people in when we need to. Okay. Or you could even eventually be artisans if we needed another group of them. Okay, so you're chickens. And I can't get that choice here. I can? Can I put chickens in beforehand? Didn't realize I could do that. Let's do three of you. Chickens. People haven't moved in yet, but at least the construction can get working. And that stays at medium. Uh, I'm expecting another click. Medium. Medium. Why is it not clicking? Interesting. Oh, you're already here. You're pinned. That's why you're not clicking. Yeah, I, like I said before, I don't see those edges. I really don't. I just see the middle. I see where my mouse is. Hmm. So, is Gandalf good for a while? Everything got turned off. Everything got brought in. Everything's done there. Farm has this in it. Do we want to deal with livestock? How is the sheep doing? So much for getting a, a sheep born every 10 days, if I read that right. Maybe I didn't. Do you have any kind of... No, no no rules written in there for us to know how that works. Um, policies? Upgrades? Um, can I find any rules regarding sheep breeding in development points? So, there... Question mark. Where would you find information on sheep breeding military upgrades you think upgrades it's not alphabetical though and i don't see the word sheep in there so resources deposits uh buildings i don't know if there is instructions on something like the concept of sheep breeding sheep generic storage that's all i'm gonna get okay so i thought the rule was it had been changed to one lamb per 10 days per couple with the new update but that's apparently not what's happening you have somebody in here is there anything that I'm missing 
herd sheep waiting herds sheep advanced livestock not registering you can handle five you can handle 45 you are pull into here waiting you are herds sheep but what does that mean you're done now you came out here you're going home you're going to come through walk right through the fences so apparently fences aren't don't mean anything uh burgage plot is done in gandalf and herd sheep hmm that means walk out to the middle of the field and waiting so they're not actually doing anything okay um we could put a family in and get say two more lambs just to see if that helps get things moving one family in trade um we were doing mules with that we could kick that up to 10 mules right we have space for for what is that six more animals take you to 10 and let's take lambs to import two lambs we already have the two sheep all right we'll let that one run it's not going to cost us that much and we'll see if next episode we actually get some progress it won't be our lambs but we'll have two sheep and two lambs we'll see how long it takes for that to to change um otherwise over here we are making flour we have a lot of grain so you guys are oh grain 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 you guys are threshing that's right so put one back in here let you guys thresh and i've got to make sure yeah over there we're, we're we still have plenty going on as far as farmers okay so you'll stay in for much of the winter and just thresh you will turn that into i don't think i need to i i don't think so they yeah they don't have they have nowhere to go whereas these guys have got to walk over and get it and go back and then these guys will go and get that to here and then these guys will just grab it and, and work so do we have any bread yet red ones the process has started uh malting we have smithy malt so we have 25 malt do we do we have a brewer this was going to be the brewer it's a burgage plot we never said it you are now the brewer all right so that's being done the chickens went in i saw that the one at least though well, there's chickens right there so you are under construction the chickens are there but the coop is not what does the coop look like right here cool coop and it just moved the junk pile over is that what's what i'm getting or is that part of the coop unassigned families for construction oh we do have to pull one back somewhere huh darn which one will it be let's pull one of you back, guys back okay so has that done us any good over here yet uh you're there so nope and that one's helped and that one's helped okay and food real quick seven months food and six months fuel and where am i at i'm at that one hour mark but there'll be a lot awful lot that i'll be editing back out so i'm gonna go another maybe 15 minutes all right so gimli we decided is doing fine you guys are over here doing this stuff one two three all of you all of you so something is happening in all of them now um we were waiting for this to get finished and i i thought okay when i see it no we did that already we did that advanced and they're in okay they're in and how soon can i order one more oxen so i've got four for the the uh where am i it was kind of out here it's the place I can never find anymore. It's you. So I can do it. Another one. So four oxen for the two farms, and then I want two oxen for um, uh, the town. You're the other hitching post. Let's go ahead and upgrade you as well, though there's nobody here to do it. And then we'll get another oxen in there as well. So that gives four for farming and two for the town. And that'll be a good point for a while because I'll set one maybe one of these for the saw pits and logging and yeah we'll see we'll see how that works out so i'm running we're october you guys are going to have to get everything plowed first and then you'll start spreading seed yeah i'm pretty sure the plowing all happens first 
until... Oh, you guys are casting. Okay, because you two are plowing. And this is being plowed. This is being plowed. And the ox is dealing with all the rest of them. So they can't do it if they wanted to. So that means one is ready for sowing where everything else is still in the process of being plowed. Okay, that makes sense. You are needing a family, okay? And unassigned families, unassigned families, exposed, getting wet, and Samwise. Are you still here? Tell me you're going to go get it. Um, nothing popped. Is that old? Exposed. It's not here anymore. Oh, good. Now, where did it go? Did it go to the farm? Where is the farm? Here. Or did it go to storage? Uh, no barley left. Storage has grabbed it all. Well, no, there's just 28. Wait a minute. So you're not in that barn. Are you in this Are you in this farm? Not there. Not there. And only a little bit is there. What are we saying we have? Barley, 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 barley. Where am I looking? Barley, seven. Seven in storage. Seven right there. So they're processing it all. Malt guys are going crazy? How much malt? That is this one. Right? I'm trying to find the word malt. There you are. You're three. How many ale? 34 ale. It feels like the math's not working right now. Barley. So we had a hundred and something. Now we have seven and three malt and 34 ale. Where's all the other? We didn't just haul a massive amount over here, did we? Barley is 148. Wow. I think the pack station's just turned on. I'm starting to come to that conclusion. Yeah, wow. The spears suddenly went over, and the barley came over in huge quantities. That means we're about to run ourselves out of meat and uh, berries, aren't we? I'm going to pause this for a moment. I'm going to have to shut things down. Uh, suddenly, it's, it's, it's too powerful. Um, over here... We had one or two berries. Now we have 185. Wow. Okay. Until I get time to think this through, um, this seems to have come back to life. So let's no barter all of these. And I guess pull the families. No, I'll leave the families. They may all be mid-journey and they may just dump goods all over the roads or all over the countryside. So we will... Just um, no barters, and hopefully they will complete whatever circuit they're on. Okay. Wow. What a difference. Okay then. Um, so apparently we we can move things now between regions. I. Wow. I was about to try to make everything self-sufficient because I couldn't trust it, but all of a sudden. Yeah, it turned on. Hmm, I don't know why. I don't know what changed. It's still 972. So why didn't it work last time? Unless it took saving it and then restarting it for the, some of the new rules to take effect. Is that a thing? I don't know. Uh, construction flax. So kind of keep an eye on this. So we've got, well, two... Yellows, a yellow, and kind of two yellows. So we'll see how that changes next time. Barley, still got this great big thing over here. Which tells me that's not coming back. This one might. Barley? Yeah. This might. That's not. But we'll see how that goes. Am I... I can run now. I've turned everything off. Yeah, I'll turn all the pack stations off. So you guys are... Sewing? No, you are plowing like crazy, and you are going to help them finish this one now. And then after that, everything should be available for sowing. You guys are casting seeds. You are sowing 99%. Okay, so that's it's happening. 
All right, so we're going to ha still have a decent crop come out of this province of Samwise next autumn, a year from now. And it's not the place that I wanted it to happen, but it's still possible to happen while we figure out what's happening here. Gimli, one last look at you, and I think I need to be turning this off. I needed this happening, and it is now. So put a family in there, and planks are at 15. So let's pull a family from what I need for a church. You, houses, church, uh, need 20. Arrgh. Okay, I'll leave you alone for a little bit. Let's look at this again. No logs. Five in storage. What are you doing? You're loading up and taking it to storage. Okay, so did that alter anything? No, we're still at 15. So we either sit here and wait for a log to show up, or we just give up for a little bit. Yeah, we give up for a little bit and get firewood in the system and get uh, leather in the system. Okay, so you guys are turned off. You're turned off. Nobody is running that. That's fine. And... Let's see, you are hunting still, and food, food is nine and one. Don't know if I dare turn you off, but you are going to quickly tan some of that. You already have two leather in there. Quickly tan some of that, and unfortunately, I'm going to leave you in there if we want to run a stall. Hmm, see how that goes. 51%. But it wasn't enough. We were already in October, and we didn't roll. So we'll see if November we get somebody else. But otherwise, I need to get this one built. Log's already there. And as soon as that's done, I'll put somebody in there. They will quickly make some firewood, and that'll be happy. And hopefully it'll be happy before November, before, before snow hits. We should be fine. There's only five houses to satisfy. So it won't take that long to uh, get ahead of the curve with a, a town so tiny. So with that, timing-wise, I think I'm probably about there. Any last-minute changes here? One family, we got them all out of here except for the one. 120, 119, turning it into grain. You should be able to stay ahead of. Grain is over there. Flour is there. So these guys should be fine. Grain and flowers being brought over to here. Flowers over there, heading back into here, making bread. So that gives us food variety of meat and vegetables and berries and bread is going to be coming up. We're actually looking pretty good in Gandalf now. This time last year, we were not. We were really worried. We were going into a starvation winter, but yeah, we pulled it off. Okay. So with that, I think I'm going to call this one done, and hopefully next time, maybe we'll get some answers over here and figure out what's happening. But wow, that pack station system. It just took off. Interesting. So we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching, folks. Bye-bye.